Storm Tracker weather starts now with Chief Meteorologist Ryan Dennis. Welcome back, everyone. We have had beautiful summer weather today, so hopefully you've been able to spend some time outdoors on the Opportunity Bank of Montana weather camera. We have had a lot of blue sky and a lot of sunshine around for the entire day today. And it has been dry again today as well. It is warm outside as temperatures are currently in the mid to upper 70s and low to mid 80s. And these temperatures are near to a little bit above average for this time of year. And just a little bit breezy right now. Sustained wind speeds currently between 5 and 15 miles per hour. In Upper Lower Ridge, is currently in control of our weather, which is why we have had very nice weather again today. This ridge will partially be in control of our weather tomorrow, which means it will continue to be warm. But as we go through tomorrow, a disturbance is also going to be working its way through Montana. So we are going to have a chance to see a few showers and thunderstorms, and it will be cloudier tomorrow than it was during the day today. And then as we head into Thursday and Friday, this upper level trough that's currently located on the Pacific Ocean will be working its way through southern Canada and the Pacific Northwest. And this will provide us with cooler, windier, and wetter weather for Thursday and Friday. Showers and thunderstorms storms are likely throughout much of Montana on Thursday and by Friday high temperatures are only going to be in the 50s and the 60s for most of us which is well below average for this time of year. We are going to have mainly clear skies and dry conditions for the rest of this evening and tonight. A little bit of patchy fog may also develop tonight along central and eastern portions of the high line. Tomorrow we will start the day off with sunshine but we'll have increasing clouds as we go through tomorrow morning and into tomorrow afternoon. We will be mostly dry during the morning but as we head into the afternoon afternoon and the evening. Not expecting a lot of precipitation in north central and central Montana, but there will be some scattered showers and thunderstorms around, including around the Helena area. So please keep an eye to the sky if you are going to be outdoors at all later on tomorrow as you may run into a thunderstorm or two. As we head into tomorrow night, we are going to have partly cloudy skies with some scattered showers and thunderstorms around throughout the night. And then on Thursday, that's when a strong cold front is going to be working its way eastward through the state. So showers and thunderstorms are likely on Thursday around the Helena area, especially during the morning. That's when we have the best chance to see that precipitation. Now, as that cold front works its way into eastern Montana, that's when we could potentially see a few severe thunderstorms developing. And if we do see any severe thunderstorms on Thursday, Damaging winds, so wind above 58 miles per hour, large hail, so hail above an inch in diameter are going to be the main hazards, but an isolated tornado is also possible. And the sphere threat will be higher the further east in the state you go. So round and west of I-15, really not expecting any severe thunderstorms on Thursday. If we do see any severe thunderstorms, damaging winds will be the main hazards. But in eastern portions of central Montana and eastern Montana is where some severe thunderstorms are possible during the day on Thursday. The wind will diminish as we go through this evening, just a light breeze overnight tonight. Tomorrow, just a little bit breezy with sustained wind speeds between 5 and 20 miles per hour. That wind will die down as we head into tomorrow night, but then as we head into Thursday, as that cold front does work its way through our area, the wind is going to increase. So it is going to be windy on Thursday. Along the Rocky Mountain front, could see some gusts up to 50 miles per hour. It will be breezy elsewhere on Thursday with sustained wind speeds between 10 and 25 miles per hour. And wind gusts up to 40 miles per hour are going to be possible at times. Pleasant temperatures tonight. Lows are going to be in the upper 40s and low to mid 50s. Warm tomorrow with highs in the 80s, but we cool down heading into Thursday's highs are only going to be in the mid to upper 60s and lower 70s. Even cooler on Friday with some more scattered showers and thunderstorms. And then partly cloudy and warmer on Saturday with a high of 81.